Baldness in males, why is it so common these days? Why are we seeing individuals as young as 20 losing their hair? And why is that a problem considered as old age is seen more commonly in younger individuals these days? Today, let us discuss about how we can delay the whole problem of baldness and what are the things we can do about this. Hi, this is Dr. Ravli Elimanchli, Chief Dermatologist, Nea Dermatology and Aesthetics. Baldness or androgenetic alopecia is a genetic condition. In this, your gene is directing your male hormone dihydrotestosterone to cause thinning of your hair. This is a very natural ongoing phenomenon in your body because your gene is designed certain way. Let us understand if there is any permanent solution for baldness and can you completely reverse this condition. Unfortunately, there is no permanent solution for baldness and there are treatment options that help in slowing down the process of baldness. But did you realize that earlier what is considered as a problem of old age and we used to see men above 50 years of age balding but now we see younger individuals in their early 20s and 30s balding. This along with the genetic constitution is mainly because of a factors like your lifestyle and other conditions like insulin resistance. Yes, insulin resistance is a problem which kind of aggravates or worsens and fastens the baldness process on your hair. So some of the things we can do to slow down the process of baldness, number one, lifestyle changes. If you're someone who has insulin resistance, if you're overweight and you do not have any physical activity, please make sure these factors are addressed to slow down the process of baldness. Number two, using certain medications like minoxidil, finasteride to slow down the process of baldness. These are the only medications which are FDA approved for male patent hair loss and there's a lot of research behind this. Number three, certain in-clinic procedures like PRP or a growth factor concentrate therapy. This procedure helps in improving the thickness or density of your hair and if you are someone who is noticing baldness in your early 20s depending on the grade of baldness and depending on how severe the process is we choose different treatment options to give you the best results please understand that baldness has no permanent solution with treatment you can only slow down the process of baldness somebody who is planning to get a hair transplantation done for their advanced stages of baldness they need to understand that even hair transplantation is not permanent and you need to use minoxidil and finasteride to maintain the results and slow down the process of thinning in the rest of the hairs. If you're someone who's noticing baldness in the early years of your life and if you think lifestyle is playing a key role in progression of your baldness, please comment below if we can provide you with some tips how to delay the progression of your baldness. If you find this video informative, please like, share and subscribe to my channel.